Um, when it comes to any sort of renovation that is typically a larger renovation and where we're affecting multiple rooms or it can just be one large component of a living level, um, more often if the client was to move out, the time frame of the renovation can be shortened quite a lot. Um, if the client wanted to live through the renovation and we're doing a two-story or we're taking a big component out, it can, be, it can take a lot longer because we're staging, um, we're completing spaces for then the client to move back into and then we're moving downstairs and starting another renovation. Um, the time factor can drag out quite considerably. Um, the relationship between the client and the builder obviously would like it to always be good, but you know, as the builder and designer, we would like to get out of the client's home as quickly as possible um, so they can move back in and get some sort of normality to their life. Yeah, the, the extra cost in the client moving out is certainly something that they would need to factor into their overall renovation budget. Um, depending on the size of the renovation, it can be anywhere from, you know, two months, six months up to a year. Again, depending on the size of the renovation. So that's something that the clients would always have to factor in on top of their overall renovation budget. Um, but again, the more that you stage a renovation, the longer the process takes, not only for um, the trades coming back and completing these spaces, but the trades would, will charge you for all these extra trips. Um, you know, the product doesn't change, the workmanship and labor on site doesn't change, but all these extra trips to site um, for all those different stages, it does add up and does end up costing the client more money. Yeah, no matter how organized your team may be, um, the longer you spend on, on site, you know, sometimes can um, uh, stretch that relationship in certain ways. Like, it, you could be fully organized, your communication could be fantastic your friendship between the builder and the client can be amazing but you know you're constantly within someone's house and it just you know at some stage there could be a little bit of stress going backwards and forwards but at the end of the day if you're a professional builder and or designer and you keep that communication levels up at all times um, you know at the end of the process you know it, it becomes just a beautiful project all around yeah, like our ultimate would be for a client to obviously move out and or go away for a holiday, just whatever that may be. So then we can come in, we can um, start all the work, we can hit our timelines and schedules and basically we can bring this beautiful design to life. And it's always very satisfying um, when the clients come back and they're seeing this space come to life and it's completely changed to what they were used to before. So it's a very satisfying part and it's definitely our preference to give them that wow factor when they come back.